Kids and teenagers, the dangers of drugs and violence. Just 30 minutes ago, an organization called LEAD was set to cut the ribbon on a new Florida headquarters in Naples. Yeah, LEAD provides resources so law enforcement agencies can work with teachers, community leaders, and families on an anti-drug and anti-violence curriculum. Wait News reporter Michelle Alvarez joins us live from the new headquarters in Naples. And Michelle, how does this program work? Lois Lead, as you mentioned, plans to run their program from this building and these offices and as well as their national philanthropic operations. Now the word lead itself stands for law enforcement against drugs and the program already operates in over 44 states. They do provide resources and leadership so law enforcement agencies can work with educators, community leaders and families on anti-drug, anti-violence curriculum for K through 12 students. Sheriff Kevin Rambosk discovered the program in 2019 and his agency's Youth Relations Bureau teaches the program Too Good for Drugs to students across Collier County. We're really making a difference. Our, our company motto is we serve. We're a 501c3 charitable organization and we're here to serve the communities and we're here to make a difference in the life of everyone. You're really able to make a, a very positive interaction with our young people here and get them to learn how to make good decisions on their own. Three, two, one. Hey! Everyone here is so excited for this new building. And as I mentioned, LEAD as a program itself plans to run their program for the entire state of Florida right here from these offices. Well, that was the grand celebration of their grand opening, and I'll throw it back to you guys. All right, glad those scissors finally worked for them. <laughs> yeah, so they did. Live TV is fun, right? <laughs> Thanks, Michelle.